Alright ladies and gentlemen, this is Parasign here once again and welcome back to Silent Hill Downpour and I'm well aware of where I've got to go, so that's good but first, before we go on the right track there's a quick side quest here that I thought I'd add in I was pretty much spawned right by it upon loading the save so I thought I might as well to get that ladder you have to grab one of those little spiky sticks again which you can pretty much get from across the roads, not too difficult Literally, it's just next to a load of bin bags, so you shouldn't have a tough time really finding it. So I have no idea what to do here. I just thought I'd add it in because I was right by it. Like I've said before, I'm not really too interested in the side quests because I don't want to go out my way. But if it's pretty much right where I need to be, it's not too much of a problem. So what have we got in here? Can't really see much with the fl forensic light. Except blood splatter, but that's pretty much all you can ever see with this thing. Nothing in the kitchen by the looks of things, so I guess we're going to be going upstairs. Nothing like checking out a creepy old house now, is there? Well, I guess I'll go this way. Looks like a hospital bed. Not quite the usual bed you'd see in this kind of house. Oh, we got a crank. It's probably for the music box downstairs. Not on the table, and I don't think there's much in the bathroom by the looks of things. Maybe some ammo or something, or a healing item. Oh, we got some health, that's nice. Well stocked up on that now. And for those wondering, I got rid of my gold gun. It wasn't worth carrying rounds. When you're carrying rounds a gun, you can't really pick up a melee weapon. And I'm all about the melee weapons in this game. I just find them to be far more useful. So, yeah, I binned the gold gun. I didn't want to bin my nail gun either because I was well stocked up on ammo for that. I barely had any handgun bullets. And a gold gun isn't much different from an ordinary gun. So it really weren't worth keeping. But even though we went through that horrendous goddamn side quest just to get it but never mind moving on so let's see what this does put the cd on it's useless without the handle yeah and well on to that murphy give me a chance so i wonder what this does nice creepy song is that all we get out of this I think that's pretty much it. Oh, what's that? Oh, dead body just appeared, that's nice. It's very creepy now, isn't it? Where did she come from? Turn back time. Huh, turn back time? Do I have to turn it backwards or something? Let's have a look at this body. She got any goods on her? Any f goodies for me? Just says turn back time on the floor, so I guess we'll go and try and turn this thing backwards, see what it does. So, let's see. Turn it the other way. Hmm. Oh god, what's that? Oh my god, that is creepy as hell. Is he gonna get me? I just know this guy's gonna try and kill me now. I think I'll have this go nice and slow. Ah, let's make it go quicker, eh? <laughs> Doesn't make much difference. Oh, I take it, it's gonna show how she died. Very nice. Okay, that's just disgusting. How could you do that to your wife? Assuming it is your wife and not your girlfriend. Did you catch her cheating? Because if you did, it's perfectly understandable. Put the victim's spirit to rest. Oh, God. Well, that was certainly interesting, but I think I want to get the fuck on out of here because the house is starting to shake. Oh, my God. What the hell? Oh my god, what have I got to do now? Looks like we got a new enemy. A ghost of a uh, axe murderer. 
burn his soul to ashes. Okay, I don't get how I'm supposed to do that. Where are you? Come on, I'm ready for you. Come on, I can take you. You're no worry. Oh, God, he got me. I have no idea. Should I just get out of here? Uh, is this his soul? Let's try the lighter. Oh, fuck you. Don't hit me while I'm in my inventory. Oh, well. That seems to have done something. Turn back time. Very nice. Oh, well, I'm glad to have that done with. I'm taking he killed his kid and all. Sick bastard. He gets what he deserves. Let's see me health. Lowered it a little bit, but I think we're alright for now. Don't have to use any healing items just yet. So, how do I get out of here? I came in through the window, didn't I? Let's just check this kitchen again, just in case. Yep, so I think we're good to get the hell on up out of here. That was a nice little side quest. I just thought I'd throw it in. Any of you guys disappointed that I haven't been throwing in side quests? Let me know and I can try and fit. I don't want to get them all in, but I don't mind throwing in a few here and there. At least if they're on the track that I'm on. It's not too bad that way. But as long as it's not taking up too much of my time, I don't want to slow down the let's play. So, what I've got to do at this point, I've got to get to the monastery. Which is, I think, you get to a bendy, curvy road somewhere along this path. I haven't really checked, but I just, I didn't notice the little circle on the map before, but it's there. And as you can see, right there to the left, that's where I've got to go. So, pretty much, I'm on the right track. So, let's have a little look down here, dead quick. I think that's going to be our next major area of the game. Can we pull this ladder down? I guess not. And I think I've turned the wrong way, haven't I? Yep, that was the way I went down earlier. I had a little explore around the Silent Hill. And it surprised me. It's actually a really big area. It makes me think that this game's probably a lot longer than I was expecting. Oh, it looks like we've got another side quest we can take a look at. Why not? Why not? Let's have a little look. What have we got in here? So we got a strange looking mirror. And a few statues. I don't see the purpose of what I've got to do, but let's have a little explore around, eh? Why not? Oh, we got a coat. Old coat. What can I do with that? Can I wear it? It is getting a little bit nippy outside after all. It'd be nice to warm Murphy's toes up. You can't have him getting too cold now. He'll die of pneumonia. That's a strange looking mirror. Can we put the anything on this statue? No. What about this? Can I do anything here? No. Well, let's see. That's nothing. You see a few of them about. Little glowy spots with the UV light. Don't see what they really do. Anything around here? No, just another one of those waste of spaces. Has no purpose whatsoever, but it's there, so get used to it. Anything over here? Doesn't look like. Doesn't look like there's anything in here. Oh, there's a little turn there, didn't see that. No, there's absolutely not in here. What's that? It's a weird looking picture. It's enough to freak a guy out now, isn't it? Hmm. This all seems a little bit useless. There's really not much I can do in here. Can I grab that coat? What did I grab? I have no idea what I picked up that coat for. Definitely not an over there and there's definitely not an here. Let's have another look out here. Oh, that was just the door, wasn't it? I thought there was something I could do there. Can I go through here? I'm sure that's a door. Do you guys think that's a door? I'm pretty sure that's a door, but it won't let me open it. I love how I speak thinking you guys are here in the room with me. This mirror is very suspicious. Can I do anything with it? Can I wear the coat in front of it? Doesn't look like. What's that? It's another one of those pictures. I don't think there's much in this area, so let's move on, eh? 
So after a little bit of exploration and looking round and getting lost and running into side quests that I don't have too much of an interest in, I finally know which is the right track of where I've got to go. And pretty much, instead of going right, I went left, so I think I've got to learn me lefts and rights. But I know where I've got to go now, so we should be good to go to get to the monastery, which is the next major area of the game. I certainly look forward to it, and we have this little geezer blocking the way. So yeah, it's definitely just up this little hill. Always good to check the map, just to be sure. So, I'm not even going to bother with that guy. He doesn't really seem worth me time. And I take it we just go right through this gate. And it looks like another side quest over there. I'm not too interested. I've ran into enough of those buildings for one day. I've pretty much had enough. And this definitely looks like the right path. And there we are. The next major area of the game. How exciting. That was a little bit too much exploring for me. I really hate getting lost like that. It gets a little bit depressing after a while, I have to say. Have a little look around here, make sure there's no heal items or bullets. Pretty sure I might need it for this next area. What's down here? You know what? I don't even care. I, I hate feeling like I'm leaving something behind. Does this just take me to the same place? What have we got? I don't want to get myself lost again. Uh, looks like that just leads back outside, so we're going into the monastery. Oh, I can't wait. Very exciting. Just have a bad feeling that something bad is going to happen in this area, but we will soon see. Yes. May I help you? I'm Murphy Pendleton. I received this letter today, but I think there's been a mistake. Ah, oh, yes. Mr. Pendleton. We've been expecting you. You were the only family we were able to locate. Your presence is very welcome. Family? No, uh, that can't be. I mean... Bless you, child. I understand this must be very confusing for you. We've checked the records carefully, and I assure you, there's no mistake. Please, come in. He died peacefully and is finally at rest. For that at least we can thank the Lord for his mercy. He didn't leave much behind, but his few personal effects are yours to claim. What happened here? Was there an earthquake? I'll meet you in the morgue in the East Wing, when you're ready. In the meantime, please feel free to look around. We're pleased that the good Lord has allowed us to carry out his work here at St. Maria's. I'm sure you'll find your visit enlightening. <laughs> 